What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another episode of Draft to Glory. I know what you're looking at and I know what you're thinking and I fucked up massively. Um, I thought I was on my main account because, you know, I, I switch between four accounts at the moment. My main account, this account, my Road to Glory account and my The Best Foot Draft Rewards account. So I always have four things open, like when I click here... Um, and you go on to this little tab here. See how I have like different ones signed in? I, I completely forgot what one I was on. And I opened the 35k packs on this account and only realized too late basically that I'd done it. So I did have 1,059,000 coins. Um, I have got a few things in the trade pile that I got from the 35k packs that once they've sold, I'll assess the exact difference. Um, and um, basically, I'm going to have to contact EA and let them know that I'm going to transfer coins from my main account to this account. Because if I just did it without letting them know, they might see it as buying coins and actually ban the account, which obviously we don't deserve to happen. Um, but that's why the coin total in the top left is about 200,000 coins short. For what it's worth, I got nothing in those 35k packs. It was such a waste. If I got something, it wouldn't have made any difference because I would have sold it, would have got rid of the other coins, and we wouldn't have known any of the different. Um, but yeah, unfortunately, I, I made a huge mistake. And um, for that, I'm, I'm sorry. Anyway, Draft to Glory is back. Here we are. Um, I am going to be uploading... What day is it tomorrow? tomorrow? This You're watching this on Thursday. On Friday, I'm going to be uploading the Best Foot Draft Rewards and um, the New Foot Birthday stuff. Some some stuff to do with the New Foot Birthday. I'm looking at these formations here. I'm going to go with the 3 4 2 one. I'm really enjoying this formation. And I'll tell you what I would love. Striker Ronaldo. Ooh. Legend. This CDM Alaba, which would be good if we got other things to link it up with. The left wing Ronaldo, we don't want the left wing Ronaldo. We don't want the Neymar. We, I, we've we used Ibra a lot recently. I don't like him. I'm going to take legendary Costa just because I can. I'm going to go for striker next. I want that striker Ronaldo. I just want to use him. I want to have fun with him. We get. Oh, I'm taking Aubameyang. Screw that. 86. I love Aubameyang in this game. I've been playing with him a lot on my Road to Glory account. He's utterly amazing. McTarian, perfect. That is a great link so far. And now we can go with any single right mid. So if we do get like a bail, we don't. Ooh, inform Kingsley Coman. I'll go with that. Now I kind of wish I took that Alaba because he would have fit perfectly into this team. Um, unfortunately, it's not the route that we took. That's not to say that we can't get him again. Um, Zambrano looks okay. Medium, medium, six foot one. Schultz has got medium, medium, six foot one. But Schultz has got same defender, but much worse physical and much worse pace. So we'll go with that. Oh, I could go with Zuma and he links with Coman. Let's. What's his six three? Yeah, let's go with Kurt Zuma, and um, we'll see. We'll see how that develops. Let's go through the left hand side now. Left forward, we're going to take. Um, this is the new Voland, isn't it? Let's take him. Screw it. Let, let, we built a Bundesliga team recently. Let's build it into it, into it again. Um, we're going to go with the Johnson. I've been using this card as well recently because he's cheap, his regular gold card for the... Uh... What am I looking at here? This is a fresh... This is a new card. We could take him. Mm. If we put Pogba, uh, Zuma in centre... Actually, if we put Pogba down that side, that would work as well. I'm saying down that side. You don't know what that means because I can't point anywhere. Um, Modric doesn't really fit with the team. There's no Bundesliga players. I'm going to take this uh, this inform Paul Pogba. And I think if we do that, we get a lot more Ken. We indeed do. That links up a fair few players. So we do need a Bundesliga centre-back. We got Howard Dez. I could take this Rami card. It's a good card. That Howard Dez card is okay. I, I'm I'm tempted to take this Adele Rami card. Just because I like we've got so many French players in the squad right now that you know you can't really and look at that that Koulibaly card, that is perfect. Yeah, that is perfect. Ninety-one Ken without the goalkeeper. We've got a. Mm, I mean, I might, I'm going to have to say that French goalkeeper, aren't I? That puts us to a hundred Ken to kick things off with, and we've almost got an all a full informed team. I'm pretty happy with that. I would love a striker Ronaldo or a striker Bale as a super sub. That would be beautiful. Unfortunately, we didn't get offered any of those. We'll take uh, Corona um, as our first backup player. We get Ozil, Goetze. Could take Goetze. I'll take Goetze. I might not use him. Um, we actually lose Kem with him in the team. Um, but 
it's another buyer, you know, another La Liga player. Um, I'm tempted to take that Neymar as well, and just give him, just give him as a super sub, please. EA, the striker Ronaldo, the striker Bale. Oh God, oh God. Lam doesn't fit into the team. In yesterday, in the last episode or yesterday's video, you guys were screaming for me to take Lam because he linked with Neuer. But Lam doesn't get perfect chem. He's not a centre back, so he wouldn't have linked with Neuer anyway. We could take the blue Danny Alves and use him as a super sub. We could take Lewandowski and either use him or use him as a super sub. But why would you use him when you got that Aubameyang card? I'm going to take the blue Danny Alves as a as a a, a nice substitute, and um, it doesn't look like. Is that Bundesliga? That is. Let's take let's take Zila there. We lose a lot of chem because we don't have a Bundesliga centre back. That could be a problem. That could definitely be a problem. Um, let's see what we get as the last goalkeeper. So we're not getting any more informs, unfortunately. Do we have a Roma defender? No, we've got Napoli. We've got La Liga BPL or City R. This is actually turning out to be a pretty decent hybrid team. Um, you know, it's mainly Bundesliga, but there are a few others in there. That aren't. Um, let's take Demarcos. <sighs> striker Bale, striker Ronaldo. That's what I'm looking for. That's what I'm looking for. Of course, we can't get them in these positions. Perrine. Does Perrine work? Perrine works again. If we, but we don't need him unless his work rates are better, or he's like so. He's got better defending, but worse physical here. Better defending, but worse physical, but better all-round stats than Rami. What's Perrine's? Uh, Medium, medium, 5'11". Yeah, we're not going to be using him. The other guys are all much taller, I believe. I could be wrong. But um, um, Trashoras, Guarine, Ramsey, Mata, Gerard. Let's take Guarine for a super sub slot. Not that he's a super, super sub per se. Um, but you know what I'm talking about. Um, two slots left now, guys. Oh, God. It's giving me this... Take Kelvin. Has he still got five-star skills? He has. Good. Um, and then last but not least, it's going to be an absolute pile of wank, isn't it? It is indeed. And we'll go with uh, we'll go with Jonathan just because why the hell not? So this is actually a super low-rated team. Um, we only got offered one blue card, and of course we took it. Um, it's going to be a 73, an 83 rated team, maybe an 84 at best. Yeah, an 84 there. And that is the best we can get it, unless this uh, Zela card gives better than Jonatas. It doesn't. Um, we've got some nice subs in Neymar and Alves. I like the team. He's only on seven chem. We don't have a... If we did this... We, we still get 100 chem with that. Now, I know the left, these guys like lose chem. If we did that, yeah, we lose chem on that. That gives us 98 chem. Neymar's still on 6 chem. I am going to play Neymar instead of Volland. Um, we're going to do that. And if we do that, is that Johnson guy? No, we lose chem. Okay, so I'm probably going to... I think this is going to be the team. Um, it gives the centre-backs all 10 chem, which is brilliant. 6-3 medium high, love that. 6-5 high medium, a bit of an issue there, but whatever, and 6-3. So we've got a massive defence, an incredible midfield... An amazing attack and Neymar uh, on the on the bench as well. If we could get a Brazilian manager, we didn't, or a German manager, we did get the German manager. So the German manager gives a uh, Volland the correct or better chem. I don't want to say the correct chem. We get a 184 team in the end, and um, unfortunately, no striker Bale or striker Ronaldo. Um, however, would you consider this a hybrid? I would consider this a hybrid because you got Bundesliga legend, Syria, BPL, BBVA. Five different leagues and the French league. Actually, we've got six different leagues in here. That's pretty awesome. By any standards, I know like the main crux of the team is Bundesliga. In fact, it's not. There's only four Bundesliga players in it. And then there's a, a mix of everything else. I'm really happy with this team. This is an incredible hybrid. We've done a good job here. This is the team we're going to use. Let's get into the gameplay. Okay, guys, so as we get into the gameplay, my first opponent of the day has got a 4-3-3 team. He's got some very nice players there. Neymar, Griezmann, uh, Di Maria, all special versions. Iniesta, Verratti, um, Schmeichel in net. The 90, Godin and Pepe with Gaia. You know, a, a fantastic team. And this, this game actually started off really well for me. 15 minutes in, I'd created a chance or two already. He makes a save with Schmeichel that makes a categorical error. I've, I've got there with Pogba. Uh, you know, Schmeichel's off uh, off his line. We managed to get the uh, ball towards the goal, but it falls back to Volland here who cuts inside and manages to put the ball in the back of the net. So I go 1-0 up. Obviously very happy 
with uh, with the start to the game. And then, uh, you know, I fell apart in defence quite a little bit. I get the ball here with Neymar. I don't know what I'm doing there. Uh, I, how many times, I don't, you know, do I need to repeat it again? How many times am I going to gift my opponent the ball in my own box? And that's exactly what I did. Um, he he capitalised with Iniesta. Fantastic finish from Iniesta. And once again, uh, I, I get the ball at the feet of my defender. And I give it straight back to him, and Griezmann scores an absolute bang. And after he scored that second goal, it's like a flip, uh, a, a switch flipped for him. And look at this from Iniesta, and and before that, whoever his other midfielder was, just absolutely phenomenal play. You know, he, he dribbled around me once, he passed it, he dribbled around me twice, he puts Griezmann through, a lovely finish to make it three-one. And then again down the right-hand side, very unlucky for me to not to intercept that, but great skill on the ball with Di Maria, and he makes it four-one after just 38 minutes. But we did get one back just before half-time. Neymar here on the ball, gets in the box, cuts it across. There is Voland again, who slots that one home to make it 4-2. Just after half-time, we did have a couple of chances to pull it back to 4-3. I was putting a bit of pressure on him. Uh, unfortunately, that pressure didn't tell good. And uh, eventually, I gave the ball away again. And uh, he was just clinical in front of goal. You know, every time I gave him a good opportunity to, to score, he did. And uh, we get the ball here again with Neymar. I try and pass it to the midfield. For me, that's a simple pass that should connect. Uh, it doesn't connect. And, and again, he punishes me. Um, absolutely phenomenal performance from my opponent. He was by far the better player. Um, and even if I didn't make those few mistakes that I did make, I would have still lost that game anyway. He was just much, much the better player than me. So unfortunately, guys, in this episode, we get ourselves a first round exit that hasn't happened for a while. But let's get into the packs. So guys, there are times where EA fucks you. There are times where you fuck yourself, and there was a few times in this game where I, I gifted my opponent a ball here or there that led to a goal, and there are times where you're just, you know, n not on your day, you're just having a bad game. However, this game that we just lost was none of those occasions, my opponent was just absolutely phenomenal. It's rare that I get dominated in such a manner, you know, I play so much FIFA that only... Kind of like, I, I lose games to people that I'm better than, people that I'm worse than. I lose games here, there and everywhere. But I never get dominated unless it's like a very good opponent. And I went and checked his record and, and his history and stuff. Because I just wanted to see where he was at. And he's got a fantastic record of, on average, four wins to a loss. Which this year's FIFA, that is brilliant. And um, he's also got a Division 1 title under his belt as well. So he was a Division 1 winner. But he just put on a clinic. Like... Like, hats off to him. He just absolutely bossed me. from Not from start to finish. It, I, I was comfortable in the game up until I scored. After I scored, his first two goals, I, get, I gifted him possession. It doesn't really make a difference. You know, he scored six goals in total, and he could have scored more, to be fair to him. You know, like, after about four or five goals, he was kind of pissing about trying to score nice goals, and that's absolutely fine. You know, he, he had the talent to do so. Um, you know, I could have not gifted him those goals, but I was never coming out of a uh, that game with a win. You know, he, he absolutely destroyed me. And I'm really disappointed in that just because I thought this team was great. Um, you know, the keeper may be a bit weak. Um, re actually, really weak. You know, he has, he's only got one stat over 80. So, faux pas on my part there. We could have drafted a bit better in that sense. But the rest of the team is great. We've got pace. We've got power. We've got skills. We've got... A great, strong, tall defence. Koulibaly with high attack and work rate may be an issue, but probably not. But overall, my opponent in general just smashed me. And um, I was looking forward to using this team for a fair few games. And I've gone out here in round one. So with that, with going out here in round one, I'm, I'm probably going to double upload today. Because I hate, I, hate, I hate giving you guys draft the glories where there's only one set of gameplay. I have got a video prepared... Uh, that was going to be uploaded in the weekend from that man of the match, Adiriz, that I might just upload as well today. So if you do want to see a double upload today, let's smash 15,000 likes on this video and I'll get you guys a second upload. So we do lose 6-2 in the first round. And if you are a winner, if you are a viewer of the, the series or a viewer of me, Appleby, um, congratulations, dude. Absolutely incredible player and, and you're far above my skill level. One day, hopefully, I'll be able to be at that level. And I was thinking about this and I was talking to Bateson about this before as well. Um, I, I would love to have the nous to get that good at FIFA. I don't know how to get better than I am at FIFA. I try. I, you know, I watch the pro players. I try and adapt things that they've got. But I never succeed in getting better. I would love to be able to get better. Um, but I, I feel like I'm at times hit my limit of how good I am. And if I ever come up against someone who's better than me... I don't know how to beat them. So I do need to work on that. However, we get a bit lucky here. We get a squad fitness card. That's not too bad. Uh, we'll send that to the trade pile. The kit probably won't sell. That won't sell. The contract will keep. Um, the staff won't sell. 
He won't sell. He won't sell. He won't sell. So we will discard the rest of those guys there. Remember, guys, I do have to give the account 200,000 coins. Um, give or take, probably like 180 after everything on the trade pile sells, which we are going to get in and go and do. But in our second pack, we get uh, absolutely nothing again. Oh, the Saints badge is what we get as our rare item. Shocking behavior there, EA. That won't sell. We'll send those to the trade pile. We will... D oh, he might sell because he's a strange nation in a, in a popular league. And right now, because of the, the, um, the seven years of fart, that's quite popular. So, guys... This is going to be the end of the video. If you did enjoy this, be sure to leave a like, rating, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. But for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.